Hey guys, what's going on? Tyler here from Style and Strings with the review of the East Coast Dye's new Hero Mesh. Alright, my initial thoughts on this, uh, it's very similar to String King, but Gemalax actually is producing this and they have their name on it and they actually had a lot of R&D together. They went out to Arizona and kind of came up with this new mesh together. Uh, another thing, it's very light, weighs 25 grams as opposed to their original wax mesh, which weighs 36. Uh, we are gonna be carrying the white, black, and gray, as well as the white and black striker, so stay tuned on our website. Uh, the other day, I was actually out shooting in the rain with uh, Mike, and uh, this stuff held up great. Uh, I actually just strung a gray piece, because we got that in, I like the color better, but uh, didn't bag out. This is the old piece I was playing with. Uh, it stayed consistent, didn't bag out, it was lightweight, and it actually dried within like 15 minutes of being done shooting, which is awesome. Um, this is the new pocket that we're coming out with. We don't have a name for it yet, so uh, you guys comment down below in the comments section here on YouTube, and we'll give you a piece of mesh if you come up with a good name for this pocket. All right guys, so there's my review of the new East Coast Dyes Hero Mesh. Make sure you subscribe to our channel for all the cool content we're about to throw at you guys. And uh, make sure you comment below for our contest. Name this new pocket we're coming out with. Win a piece of Hero Mesh. And uh, thanks again for watching. It's got my seal of approval. YouTube, what's going on? T-Bird back here for the next edition of Speed String Saturday. 